Invest in people, invest in relationships. We talk about leadership. Uh, leadership's all about people. It's all about relationships. And, and without people, without relationships, there is no leadership. There's no, there's no reason uh, for leadership if it's just, if there's no one, no one to lead, right? So um, this weekend was in California, just finished up the last and final piece to uh, this, the tattoo sleeve that I put on my arm here over the last couple of years and, and had the opportunity to meet with some old friends and some old clients. And uh, it, it was an incredible trip and it's just a, a great, it was, it was great to be able to spend some time with, with these people that I've really gotten to know at a deep level over a number of years now and to reinvest in those relationships and, and something uh, really powerful happened, right? Something really cool happened. Um, had the opportunity to stay with Michelle and Richie Perez, two very good friends that are, that are also clients of mine uh, that I've been coaching with for a number of years now. And um, there was another gentleman, his name's Mario, my, my man, Mario Perez uh, from Palm Springs. He had heard I was coming and, and made the decision to, to come over and, and make the trip over to, to visit and, and to, to reconnect. And it, you know, over an hour drive from from where he was at to where we were at, and then we had two others from Long Beach, about an hour and a half away, that uh, had heard I was coming and and decided that they wanted to come and, and visit and spend some time with me, and again made it made a trip of over an hour and a half both ways just to spend, you know, really half a day with with me, and uh, and it means a lot. Like that that's not lost on me, right? Um, and so, you know, are you the person that, you know, others would be willing to travel and sacrifice, um, time, time out of their day and, and it really an inconvenience, right? To, you know, when you think about it, you're on your weekend, um, first thing we don't want to do is to have to hop in the car for an hour and a half one way to go and maybe have the ability to spend just a couple hours with somebody and then knowing that you're gonna hop in the car and, and make the trip back, right? So uh, if it wasn't for me intentionally and in investing in these people and staying connected and staying in touch and 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 uh, continuing to pour into that relationship just as much as, as they have done the same, right? They've, they've they've reciprocate reciprocated into that relationship and so uh just very thankful right now just really thinking about that reflecting on it and uh you know i'm, I'm never would be one yes i'm i'm sharing this story in this video hopefully to help you and and for you to maybe see something in yourself that you can make a shift and a tweak in and and uh to, to better your life, to move your life forward, to move the needle in your life, to create cr create meaningful relationships for yourself as well. Um, but I'm typically not going to be the first person to speak out about types of things like this. But it, but at the same time, when we don't share them, then you know it's it's a lesson that that potentially could be had for somebody else that wouldn't be if I'm not willing to be open and share. So again, relationships. There's nothing more important, especially when it comes to leadership relationships in life. I mean, that's for me where it's at. That's, that's like the Holy grail for me is, is, is doing life with people close to you that matter to you and, and uh, pouring into those relationships and you, and you really see the results of those relationships, a true measure, right? Sim similar to how you, some will say that, right. Dep you know, who shows up at your funeral kind of shows up, uh, kind of shows the proof in the pudding and the quality of the man or the, the person that you were. Um, you know, the types of relationships that you did or did not have, right? And so um, I don't want to have to wait to my funeral to find that out because obviously I'll be, I'll be gone and passed at that point. Um, so there's proof here all around us uh, by the results that we have, by how people show up or don't show up in our lives. And, and uh, for this weekend, it was a powerful reminder to me of, of uh, I must be doing something right when it comes to creating connections and relationships and, and for me to continue to do so um, because they matter. And it almost is the only thing that matters for me. 
So uh, that's what we got for you today. Pour into those relationships, create those connections, and uh, let's go.